Good evening, I'm Erica Sargent. And I'm Brad Edwards. Officer James Hunt, the viral police officer with a history of bad behavior, is now on desk duty. If you're thinking that took a long time, it did. And he was not relieved of his police powers for the video that made him, well, viral. Put it on camera. Officer James Hunt in the summer of 2018. You said you're trying to shoot. I killed. That went viral. I killed. The CBS2 investigators were first to expose Hunt's entire interaction with Kenneth Lee that day, an innocent passerby to a police call Hunt responded to. That's when he said, I have a Snapchat too. I said, No, you don't. He said, Yeah, dude, it's called our mama. And he said, It's called our your mom. I already said it. Eventually, Officer Hunt falsely arrested Lee. Lee eventually won a $100,000 settlement with the city. I stopped talking to you. Oh. Officer Hunt's file includes 24 complaints made by civilians, two dozen that we know of, including allegations of false arrest, verbal abuse, and racist language. He also ranks at the top, almost literally, when it comes to CPD officers who report using force against civilians. At least 28 use of force complaints since 2016. At one point, that was fifth most of the entire 12,000 strong force. We now know a new complaint led to Hunt's downgrade to desk duty. The complaint, May 30th, 2020. You may remember the date. The day fallout from the murder of George Floyd by a Minneapolis cop rippled across the country. At 8 p.m., the alleged victim says she was in her car trying to escape violence in downtown Chicago. Says Hunt and other officers approached her car, shattered her back window. She ended up on the ground. Her phone, on which she was recording, was wrestled from her. Sources tell us video shows Officer Hunt called her, she's a 20-something African-American woman, called her, quote, fat and a that now has Officer Hunt sidelined. Chicago police shoot and kill a man suspected in a shooting in the East Chatham neighborhood. Hunt's been at the center of newsmaking events before. In 2014, Officer Hunt was a CPD rookie when he killed 17-year-old Deshaun Pittman. At the time, Hunt was still within his 18-month probationary period. Hunt said Pittman aimed in his direction after Pittman shot and killed another teen. Hunt was the only officer to shoot. Hunt shot Pittman 10 times, Pittman's grandmother. Did they ever say which bullet actually killed him? The shooting was deemed justified four years later. You said you're trying to shoot I killed Nearly 10 months after that, Copa recommended a year-long suspension for Officer Hunt. Even after that recommendation, and it appears after the Floyd protester excessive force complaint, Officer Hunt in 2020 was placed on the superintendent's new community safety team, the department's then latest effort to create a bridge between itself and often aggrieved neighborhoods. We were unawares of the two-year-old incident. When the CBS2 investigators informed the department that Hunt may not best exemplify community bridge building. And then we've since moved him out of that unit. Then, just this week, on the new field officer training list to start February 8th, 2022. Officer James Hunt, field training officers shape Chicago's future force on appropriate use of force and proper verbal communication. Hunt was to be trained as such this week. All the while, CPD was sitting on COPA's findings of bad behavior and recommendations for discipline in the Floyd protest incident since December. Then, the day before training began, Officer Hunt was placed on desk duty. You said you're trying to shoot I killed As for the viral park proclamation and false arrest, 1,319 days later, it is not resolved. So three years, seven months, seven days later, and a COPA recommended one year suspension. That case is still in arbitration. And while Officer Hunt is off the street, he's still on the public payroll. The police union president told us the only reason Officer Hunt got stripped of his police powers was to prevent his promotion. He called the move despicable and called CPD's administration vindictive. 
You can see my original report on Officer Hunt. Just open our app, CBS Chicago, and click on the Two Investigators tab.